morning everybody we will be giving you seven things you can do for your significant other on Valentine's Day men you know this one if you do not do anything for Valentine's Day your ass is getting nailed to the wall with that in mind you're gonna want to go out there and get yourself a gift or plan something special for your significant other on Valentine's Day anal Number one on the list is the most cliche and the most go-to. It's flowers and chocolates. This is guaranteed to make your white girl fall head over heels for you. Now, you don't have to stop there. Number two is another good one to follow up. You know, you could start in the morning with the flowers and chocolates, but the evening, she's gonna expect plans. She's gonna want something to be done. Anal. Take her out to a dinner and a movie. It's real simple, real cliche, but it's guaranteed to make your white bitch go crazy. What she didn't know is that you were watching this video just days before Valentine's Day because you had no idea what to fucking do. But, men, that's what I'm here for, to save your asses. Me, I'm single, I don't gotta worry. But dinner and a movie, flowers and chocolates. James, well, doesn't that cover a whole day, a whole nice day of Valentine's Day? Activities? Well, not quite. Cool. Well, sorry, men, you're not off the hook yet. Number three. She's gonna want you to do something sexy. Anal. Number three on the list. Ask her if she wants to try anal. Hey, babe. You wanna try anal? Anal? And she looks at you, she's like, The fuck? That's when you're like, Oh, I'm just kidding. I was just kidding if you're kidding. Yeah, like, why would you even ask that? Oh my god. Reverse pooping. <laughs> the concept to me is just a little far-fetched. Number four. Take her to a spa. Get her nice and relaxed and warmed up. On to number five. Well, number five is the tricky one. I call it the slip and slide. Slip and slide and, and then you say, whoop! Anal. <laughs> number six. Get her a nice Valentine's Day card. Something from the heart. Something written that, that is you, that is true, that is wholesome. And then lastly, number seven. Go for a nice walk in a park. And now if it's too cold, turn on a YouTube video of people walking through a park. <laughs> and cuddle, I guess. And that concludes, you know, the seven things you can do for your significant other on Valentine's Day. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful Valentine's Day. And for all the single men, single ladies out there, there are plenty of fish in the sea, but you might not be using the right thing. Have a good day.